Okay, so this is the classical Newtonian equation for kinetic energy. But however, at higher speeds, near those approaching speed of light, you need to start using the relativistic equation. But what is the evidence for this equation here? Okay, in Bertozzi's experiment, we have a particle accelerator on the left-hand side, and this produces a beam of electrons. These electrons travel from point A to point B, which is approximately 8.4 meters apart. We can figure out the time it takes to go from A to B using this oscilloscope. Uh, the time will be the difference between these two peaks as it goes past A and B. You can find the speed by simply doing the distance, which is 8.4, divided by the time between those two pulses. When, this, when the bunch of electrons hits the metal plate on the left hand side, it causes the temperature of the metal plate to increase. So we can figure out the energy, the kinetic energy of the electrons by using E equals mc delta t, where m here is the mass of the plate. So the mass of the uh, metal that's increasing in temperature. C is a specific capacity and delta t is a change in temperature. Uh, because we have a bunch of electrons here, we'll have to divide this by the number of electrons in the electron beam to get the kinetic energy of each electron. Okay, what Bertozzi did was he used the particle accelerator to change the velocity at which the electrons were coming in. And he measured the corresponding kinetic energy by using the change in temperature of the metal plate. And he plotted this on a graph. Now this is what we would expect if classical theory or Newtonian mechanics is right. The kinetic energy was half mv squared, but this is not what was obtained. Instead, we get something like this. So you can see firstly um, that the energy, kinetic energy increases quite quickly as you approach the speed of light over here. And you can see you can't go beyond the speed of light. The uh, relativistic and the um, classical equations agree at lower speeds. So that's why we've been using half equals mv squared so far, because at low speeds, it's fine, it works.